If you have just bought yourself an eye care, the first thing you will need to do is fill it with maintenance oil before the very first use. Open the cover at the top, remove the oil fill cap and insert the oil filling nozzle. Slowly and carefully pour the maintenance oil so as not to spill any. When filling is complete, securely attach the oil fill cap. Before cleaning the eye care, first turn off the power switch and remove the power cord from the unit. Wipe the unit with a cloth moistened with water, warm water or soapy water. Then wipe again using neutral detergent or alcohol wipes. You can easily detach the door to clean it separately with tap water. When detaching and reattaching the door, make sure the unit is on a level surface and be careful not to drop the door or the unit. To detach the door, simply slide the detachment lever to the left and unhinge the door from the pins on each side. Simply do the opposite to reattach the door. Make sure you are regularly checking the mist filters and oil absorbing sheet inside the unit and replacing them when signs of debris start to appear on them. Always make sure the burr end of the handpiece is facing outwards towards the mist filter so that the filter can catch any oil and debris coming out from the handpiece. When water accumulates in the air filter case at the back, press the drain button at the bottom of the case to drain the air filter. It is important that the air filter is free from moisture, so regularly check the filter just to be safe as weekly maintenance. The O-rings attached to the E-type fittings inside the unit may break or wear over time. If you notice the O-rings deteriorating, replace them with new O-rings. You can use a thin needle or a pin to remove the old O-rings and slide on the new ones. Deteriorated O-rings can result in excess oil flow from the connector into the handpiece, so it is important to check these fittings regularly. There is an additional feature on the eye care that allows you to lubricate only the head of the handpiece. Attach the appropriate fitting and place paper towel behind the head to catch any excess oil. This is particularly important for profi heads where paste tends to build up inside the head. To purge extra air through a handpiece after you have run a cycle, press the air button and the selected port at the same time to purge the air. 